All right, today is our uh, open house that we're having here. We got our uh, flags and shit up. I am gonna see what the top of this thing looks like. Uh, it's 80 feet or 100 feet or something. Let's see if I can make it. Whew, not too bad. Um, but I'll tell you what, oh boy. This is super cool. So they would have used this winch here, I'm assuming, to pull the wet hose. Yes, sir, that's hilarious. Um, up here, then they would drape it over these hooks. And then at the bottom, they would light a fire. How cool is that? <sighs> yeah. That's cool, man. I'm not going to press the button. I'm sketched out. Whew. All right, let's go see what else we can find. Wow, that was exhilarating. There's our pop going on. Got my wrist is rolling. We've got our OLT. This is our uh, GPON XGS Pond filter. And then, of course, I've got my DWDM coming in passive. Uh, yeah. So a little out of breath. Uh, let's go check out the rest of the place. All right. So we got our sign, and then we got the firehouse lofts sign. It really sets it off. Uh, once the doors come back down, uh, it really does look pretty, uh, pretty much like a firehouse. So, those windows are in your living room. And there is one uh, unit on the first floor, but let's go check it out. The fire, uh, the fire department is coming. And there's gonna be a ceremony of sealing the corner. This is the original cornerstone. They took with them when they moved to the firehouse. That's how they normally do that. They brought it back for us and we are going to seal it with a ceremony with the mayor or something and uh, put it back uh, where it belongs and uh, as you can see it's just a little gap there awesome entrance to the building any figure figure you're coming uh, you're coming home and check out this Kirk really did a good job in all this. Oh, it's so clean in here. I'm almost afraid to come in. So, here you are. I think a bunch of people are coming. So, as far as fiber goes, every unit has fiber. Um, and f uh, devices in here. Then they have a Cat 6 at every um, station. Cat 6 up. This is the handicap unit. This is up for um, a TV, pretty much. Sinks like that because it's a handicap. This countertop is pretty awesome. <clears throat> I think all the bathrooms have just motions. Nope. Walk-in shower. I guess this is a roll-in shower. Um, but look at your ceiling heights. That's a nine, I think it's like a 12 foot ceiling, I guess, 10 foot, mm, maybe 11. Pretty cool like living room, your living room kind of kitchen combined. <clears throat> and it's another bedroom with a bath. So let's go check out one of the really cool ones upstairs now that they're all done. Mm -hmm. This is um, actually allows you somebody to the three um, garages are for rent. 
for um, whoever would want them. Okay, nothing, nothing fun to see there. <laughs> Looks like it means anything. I don't think so. I'm starting to, based on what my shoes sound like, I'm starting to think it does mean something. We'll go in the back door. Just the back, back door. Oh yeah, this is a good one. So, just imagine how high ceiling this is crazy so I don't even know what this is. this is like 20 foot curtains it's wild yeah. now this one it's different it actually has a wall here we'll go we we'll go take a peek at one that doesn't <clears throat> I think you got here you got a stacking uh -oh. over here a stacker washer and dryer stainless steel stuff You pretty much got to figure this is a historic restoration. So the fact that all this is like looking like this, it's really, it's really a testament to Kirk. I mean, he's a pretty wild cat. <clears throat> that ceiling fan. Yeah, what? is going on right now this is the coolest fire truck ever no way dude how is it that clean No way. I've got a feeling that guy really is uh, loving his job. How is that for a apartment grand opening, huh? It's Kirk. Kirk's got his shaking a rug.